सो स्लाइड्स आर सीन ना ऑनरेबल मैडम स्लाइड्स आर नॉट सीन नाउ विजिबल ओके सो वेरी नाइस मैडम एंड सर अच्छा भी कोई है ना थैंक यू वेरी मच आई एम इंट्रोड्यूसिंग माई सेल्फ है ना प्रोफेसर मान सिंह सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ गुजरात एंड आई बिलीव इन रिमेनिंग स्टूडेंट होल लाइफ एंड आई वर्क इन एरिया ऑफ दिस फिजिको केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ नैनो मेटीरियल्स सेंसर्स एकस्टिक मेटीरियल्स फोटोल्यूमिनेसेंट मॉलिक्यूल्स एंड थिन फिल्म फॉर्मिंग मॉलिक्यूल्स एंड दोज मॉलिक्यूल्स विच आर फंक्शनल ग्रेफीन ऑक्साइड फंक्शनाइजेशन एंड फोटो कैटलाइज सो माई दिस टूडे लेक्चर मे बी ऑन द ऑलमोस्ट द फिजिको केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज हाँ सर थैंक यू सर फिजिको केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज लाइक वी नो वेरी वेल दैट आई आर इट सेल्फ इज ऑल्सो ए फिजिको केमिकल प्रॉपर्टी एंड हीट सेंसिंग थर्मामीटर मरकरी वी नो वेरी वेल सो इनिशियली आई वुड लाइक टू इंट्रोड्यूस द कंसेप्ट ऑफ फिजिको केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज एंड हाउ डू दीज प्रॉपर्टीज आर जनरेटेड so the molecules and materials uh, and electrons everything so <clears throat> uh, if i quote a simple example of uh, dye we know that uh, textile fabrics uh, is a molecule which is sensing the light and generating its own phonons and they are within this color but the structure of the molecule remains as such so uh, we could say that uh, this dyes they are sensing the light uh, and uh, if we also uh, <clears throat> because they have uh, robust uh, uh, electronic transition activities in their structure and hence uh, they respond to the light uh, but uh, we do not know that uh, similarly whether they will respond to the magnetic field or uh, uh, thermal energy or uh, electrical energy Uh, <clears throat> so uh, these points they distinguish that the specific molecular structure uh, they have a specific uh, set of uh, uh, emitting properties or sensing properties so uh, in that context uh, <clears throat> we can say that uh, uh, and we know very well that uh, uh, whenever we are uh this uh, <clears throat> dealing with so many materials and uh, pen computer ink uh, plastic materials they have their own geometry despite geometry they have their own uh, this uh, surface energy and uh, which is at the surface uh, we know that uh, non sticking paints are in practice these days for cooking uh, because uh, the purpose of uh, that is that the surface energy is completely minimized and we uh, so that uh, <clears throat> uh, uh, nothing is sticking on that so uh, we could uh, explore the potential and the and the probable industrial applications of the surface energy that uh, uh, economy also when you are uh, wash cooking food on the non sticking fry pan and then either oil or some carbohydrates or proteins whichever uh, food items are brought in contact of that surface uh, they do not stick and uh, uh, then washing whenever you are washing them so no detergent is used no water is used so uh, we could say that uh, so concept is that surface energy minimizing and it is leading to another economy as i told you what is a valuable resource so it does not mean that it is in isolation uh, the specific properties not in isolation but they have their different dimensions 
uh, economic dimensions and uh, uh, using resources. So uh, uh, these uh, uh, properties basically, as I quoted the example of uh, this uh, uh, non-sticking paints, uh, fry paints and that uh, textile fabric, if we see the example of dye, they are highly sticking to the textile fabric. So uh, their surface energy because uh, their structure is almost uh, uh, heteroatomically different structure. So that way these uh, properties are generated and uh, uh, authentic sensor in the sense that uh, uh, if you have any molecule, for example, uh, uh, you take benzene, and then uh, you take uh, benzoic acid and uh, if you subject it to the IR then uh, the molecule uh, itself responds differently that indicates that but uh, the structure remains as such structure does not uh, undergo uh, that uh, damage structure remains as such. So uh, such molecular substances uh, not only uh, act as a good source of physicochemical properties but these properties could easily identify or characterize the molecules. We know very well that uh, curcumin is, an, is the excellent uh, antioxidant and we also know that uh, this uh, jugglery jugglery is uh, uh, processing uh, when we take the raw that time it is uh, color is uh, this uh, uh, radish and uh, it is full of uh, antioxidants and useful but when different chemicals are brought for processing color also whitish and so many things uh, went out and then pro 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 yes madam last five minutes okay okay madam thank you so yes yes madam so we could say that uh, uh, that uh, molecules, whenever they are subjected to different situations, and they remain, uh, their structure remains as such. So uh, we could say that, or we could uh, find a terminology that thermodynamically and kinetically stable structures, and they could display the unique physicochemical properties, as I have quoted few examples, uh, which uh, not only reveal the structural frameworks of the molecules. Uh, but also find uh, that what are the effective structural constituents of that specific molecule, whether this molecule is having certain electrostatic structure or certain functional groups are there, amino, carboxylic or some other. And uh, for example, we know the salt which is in the proteins. So ultimately, uh, this uh, physicochemical properties and, uh, and the structural <coughs> that uh, uh, framework uh, they go hand in hand and uh, 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 when they go hand in hand then they could act as a good sensor for structural determination for identification of the specific constituent, constituents. So for example if we take an example of soya bean cooking it takes longer time but rice uh, uh, does not take uh, longer time it takes shorter time. So such experiments could also be a good sensor of the molecules because we know soya bean as a uh, it has salt bridges stronger electrostatic uh, uh, dipoles and the uh, alpha beta uh, that uh, uh, litigated sheets or we can say that uh, uh, protein folding primary secondary uh, tertiary and quaternary so that way the stronger hydrogen bonding are there so we could say that uh, when any molecule is taking longer time in cooking, that time its structure or it could be having certain stronger hydrogen bonding. While if we take the rice uh, full of carbohydrate and it takes shorter time, we could say that uh, <clears throat> the stronger hydrogen bonding or stronger electrostatic dipoles mechanism is missing in the rice as a carbohydrate in potato also. Uh, however, we know very well that uh, when uh, we uh, this uh, cooking of uh, soya bean or boiling egg, uh, that time uh, this is uh, because uh, the hydrogen bondings are completely gone and then they could uh, be the structure is uh, 
or the the, the particle the uh, soya bean or uh, egg uh, yolk and others they become brittle so uh, uh, these are the excellent uh, not only uh, the structural as well as the properties correlation shape but industrial uh, that uh, utility also so uh, we also know very well that uh, if we take the example of uh, co2 it is causing a global warming while if we take the example of the nitrogen be, being 78% in the environment but there is no it is not causing any global warming this proves that somewhere the electronic configuration is the genesis of the physical chemical properties we know that co2 uh, keep shifting its electro because there are two uh, oxygen atom electronegative it attract the shared lone pair electron so it develop the uh, partial charge on the carbon and negative on this so that way uh, it could uh, respond to the heat and then when it respond to the heat then other another molecules want to come in contact of this that's why we know that it is uh, uh, this uh, dry ice co2 because it is having uh, that uh, uh, partial charges on the molecule and these partial charge they interact they similar molecule come together and when similar molecule come together then it becomes a solid substance at the low temperature so free cohesity in the sense that cohesive forces are developed within the co2 but uh, if we raise the temperature then these cohesive forces are weakened and then molecule individually move here and there so no adherence while when we are ap applying this uh, strong uh, uh, lowering temperature then it is uh, coming together so frico has it in the sense that frictional forces or we can say adherence uh, and uh, the cohesive cohesive forces they come uh, as as i quoted the example of co2 that low temperature they come together so cohesive forces generated and it is not able to move so no frictional forces in the environment so if co2 is uh, captured somewhere then it will not cause the global warming when it is dispersed then definitely it is adhering either heat or some other molecules that's why this is the situation cooking food in cooker the, we know the metal respond to heat without deforming the cooker cooker remains as such does not mean that cooker is deformed and the electrons of cooker are gone it is not oxidized so it means that uh, when the metal uh, it is getting heat then uh, it goes to the higher excited state and they come back that the phonons are emitted that electrons are not going but phonons are emitted and then it remains as such so these are the properties in the sense that it is a heat sensitive and it is passing the heat to the food grains so uh, these are the materials where uh, we could talk about uh, uh, the situation of uh, the materials and properties are responding to the different uh, uh, external forces so uh, we know that uh, 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 if we take the fruit juice and uh, take some processed food or some syrup or something else though we try to develop the uh, that uh, excellent uh, adherence of the water and the ingredient like juice but uh, juice is the natural uh, adherence a very fixed amount of cohesive force and very uh, fixed amount of the adhesive forces and in the specific stoichiometric ratio so it could easily be uh, uh, circulated in the uh, or be carried out by the blood in the tissues so it is not causing any undesired uh, that uh, interaction or reaction while if we take some processed uh, uh, that uh, juice type or liquid diets that time because it is uh, uh, processed or many undesired things are added preservative and so many things so that becomes a uh, difficulty so they interact and when they either adhere or they undergo coagulation so these are the properties and uh, now in the same context there are different uh, properties like interacting properties binding properties mixing moderating potential hydrogen bonding as i quoted few examples surface and bulk phases so there are several uh, that are uh, different properties surface tension and uh, uh, liquid liquid interfacial Uh, that uh, sciences or interfacial science in the sense that uh, oil water they come together and they develop the interface while the ethanol water they are not making so now if you take this example that uh, uh, this is going or a best example of the uh, physicochemical uh, properties and sensing the tears of the wine 
So this tears of the wine in the sense we know very well that uh, when we take uh, uh, this uh, alcohol and water in a specific ratio, we mix them together. When we mix them together, we shake that uh, uh, this uh, uh, glass of wine. So what happens? It uh, comes uh, to a, uh, to the wall up to certain height. And when we leave it as such, then what happens? The surface uh, energy of the ethanol uh, is different than of the water. And uh, the, the cohesive force of surface tension of the water is higher than the ethanol. So uh, when higher than ethanol, that time what happens? That uh, ethanol, uh, because it is having higher surface tension means lower uh, surface energy and uh, lower surface tension means higher surface energy. So wine or ethanol has lower surface tension, higher surface energy. So what happens when uh, if this is sticking to the wall, then it responds to the heat easily to, of the environment and it is easily evaporated. While water does not evaporate, it, it comes together or cohesive forces. Water comes together and uh, uh, when water comes together, then it develops a, uh, a drop type of structure or, or coming down tear like structure. So this is the best example that uh, and this tear like structure could be, uh, uh, could be predicted and could be assumed as the pendant drop. So uh, the basic, uh, basically the uh, molecular engineering starts with certain example, these are natural example where this phenomena or this chemistry is expressed only by the cohesive forces and the adhesive forces because it was a whole mixture, uh, ethanol and water, homogeneous mixture, it was sticking to the wall and when adhered to the wall, so adhesive forces were there and when uh, it was left certain, for certain time as such, then ethanol starts evaporating and then when ethanol starts evaporating, then water, water molecules uh, strongly they come together because water was slightly interrupting them to come together. Sorry, ethanol was interrupting them, uh, engaging them uh, as a solubili for solubilization. So when ethanol started uh, to go to evaporate, then water started uh, to come together and it developed this tear. So uh, this is the best example that uh, uh, this uh, two forces are working here. The adhesive forces or the frictional forces because frictional means they are sticking together and the cohesive forces they are making drop. So we could say that uh, this physical chemical property is directly a frequency, nothing else. Because two forces, the phenomena is the outcome of the two, uh, basically two phenomena. So we could uh, consider it as an excellent, uh, this parameter. I am not saying that uh, we should take wine. We are the option of the juice. People can take juice. And uh, as I quoted the example, natural, this, uh, I am not saying it is a 100% uh, uh, this uh, nano emulsion. Uh, but it is near to the uh, nano emulsion because micro emulsion and see the example uh, what happens that uh, nano emulsion in the sense uh, when uh, the properties or ingredients are uh, are in uh, are mixed in one is to one ratio then it becomes a transparent because uh, distribution of the ingredient in your mixture they are 100% everywhere equal so uh, when they respond to the light the light is scattering, there is no diffraction, refraction as such, whatever light comes because there are no different light scattering centers. There is only one light, a single unit, single crystal unit. So that way we can say that uh, uh, this uh, <coughs> nano emulsion and cohesive forces and frictional forces are almost equal. So that does not mean there is a tendency like a previous slide, there was a tendency that cohesive force were stronger and as the ethanol was evaporated, so this water comes together developing a tears or wine or cohesive forces. So they remain as such there and this is an excellent property where we could say that such formulations uh, are not going to get coagulated. So if such food or such juice we take then it will start flow automatically uh, be carried out by the our blood circulatory system. It will go to the tissues and cells and then we will get a good food. There is another example we know very well that in the journalist bilirubin protein is there. So the person who gets uh, slightly at this uh, release of this bilirubin, then uh, that uh, <clears throat> basically it uh, reduces the surface tension of the urine. So uh, this is an excellent test 
or application of this physical chemical properties of triphosphate as such so uh, we take uh, we want to check whether uh, this uh, blue rubin is released uh, in the ultimately it will be excreted out to the uh, urine through the nephrons of the kidney so nephrons may allow this and now when nephrons are allowing because uh, it is not coagulated it is not released in a uh, larger amount so it may be mono dispersed and uh, urine also becomes yellow yellowish because of this so if we take if we distinguish them then uh, the normal person's uh, uh, urine surface tension is 66 ml per meter but by chance if it is released then it will decrease so how we could check make a best use a very physical chemical test not a chemical test then we take the dried uh, uh, powder of this uh, uh, sulfur and we take two samples uh, urine sample of of the uh, person who is having uh, this uh, jaundice and the normal person so we we when we uh, this uh, uh, spread the dried sulfur powder on them so the normal person's uh, urine because it is having higher surface tension and uh, uh, the least surface energy so sulfur remains suspended at the top while while the uh, the person uh, the person who is having or the urine sample with bilirubin then the sulfur particle will go to down will go to bottom so uh, we could uh, check that uh, yes uh, this is uh, uh, very uh, <coughs> Uh, uh, physical chemical property surface tension is also very interesting uh, so physical chemical property <coughs> and it is checking that the jaundice could be checked uh, with this uh, <coughs> molecule or this device so this is called that uh, <coughs> hay test he was a scientist and similarly Uh, this uh, this infectant because their surface energy least so they could enter the bacterial cell wall and disrupt and then they could act as a disinfectant and <clears throat> this generation are because of because different molecules having different kind of bonds and uh, does not mean that uh, all the time sigma bond where energy or electrons are uh, completely hybridized and 100% hybridized hybridization but uh, there are double bonds electrostatic interactions or electrostatic atoms so uh, they become shifted to one side another side and so these are the genesis of the uh, molecules which generate uh, either which which which, which uh, go uh, for the coagulate coagulate coagulating mode or the dispersing mode or the adherence mode so these are the different properties which could uh, <coughs> be Uh, expressed by the electronic configuration itself and uh, <coughs> we know that uh, uh, molecules as i told you that uh, uh, blood is a capillary science is a prominent in the plants in the living beings this is the best medium which is uh, which is uh, uh, <coughs> sending or supplying the uh, food to the tissues and to the uh, required cells all the cells so the nature of the <coughs> uh, uh, liquid transporting liquid also very important so uh, now if we take the example of uh, uh, this uh, uh, protein if we take the protein in the water uh, dissolve the protein in the water and uh, <coughs> we uh, try to see whether it's a, it's a nature uh, in the water uh, remains same or uh, we could say that uh, it's a shear or viscosity uh, or these uh, frequency remains the same with time or changes so we have we, we find that or we generally see in our day to day experiments that uh, the <clears throat> uh, proteins with time they get uh, uh, unfolded but they get when they get unfolded then their physical chemical properties does not remain same so such liquids they are called non newtonian liquids but uh, when if you add ethanol and water together and their uh, closed system not the open system then if you if we measure every time the proper this uh, uh, shear or any physical chemical property it may almost remain same so it is also an indicator time here becomes an indicator that with time the properties physical chemical property the protein they are changed so it reflects that there are structural changes if it remains same then we could say there is no structural change 
Now we know very well that when we cook the, uh, this pulses and we keep it time in, com in comparison to uh, green vegetable and other, this <coughs> pulses get dry. So why it get dry that water which was uh, surrounding them, now there were certain, still certain uh, electrostatic uh, uh, molecules or electrostatic bonds or, and they acquire the water and it becomes dry. We generally we see in our day-to-day -day experiments. So different kinds, different patterns of uh, this uh, <coughs> uh, flows, especially in the capillary and uh, turbulent capillary, laminar flow. If the person is doing yoga, taking normal diet and uh, not a, a processed, at that time what will happen that the turbulence, uh, turbulence, turbulent flows and these uh, interrupted flows that are generated by molecule itself, molecule itself, not naturally. So if we take that, uh, take slightly little bit caution in uh, uh, taking certain amount of uh, uh, well-defined uh, food, uh, avoiding cholesterol, not excess cholesterol. So they, uh, if the cholesterol could not be deposited in the artery and there could be a proper blood circulation and uh, <clears throat> generally we see that uh, 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 this uh, cholesterol is getting deposited and uh, ultimately uh, the the, the heart has to pump the uh, uh, blood and so uh, if too much is narrow completely narrowed down then heart will also fail and heart attack will come and so many other things may come so i am not saying this is the only reason but it could be a probable reason where such things are there so uh, this uh, laminar flows or the shear stress or, the, or surface properties they are responsible for uh, these changes coagulation because uh, this uh, uh, Cholesterol, it is not a, a very uh, interactive molecule, its surface energy is least. So whenever it is uh, with uh, blood, it is moving and because it is, it does not have too much interaction with the, or vibrant interaction with the, uh, our this uh, uh, blood system. So uh, this circulatory system, so somewhere it gets deposited uh, uh, with the one of the artery and this becomes the difficult situation. And uh, uh, we know that uh, 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 in general, uh, what happens that uh, the viscosity of the of the blood is almost three four times than the water. Uh, if it is uh, very high, then it may not be able to to uh, do know uh, pass on the uh, or to pick up the nutrients and the oxygen also. But if it is very very slow, that time also difficulty. So it should be normal. And it is found that uh, three to four millipascal. Uh, uh, second is the uh, unit of this, uh, which is uh, uh, this 3 4 uh, millipascal second uh, viscosity of blood is a very uh, uh, moderate, which is supplying the nutrients and oxygen. So, different it means uh, this coagulation, as I quoted the example, if uh, it is uh, the cholesterol, if it is in a fine particle equally distributed everywhere, then its surface area, surface energy higher and then it will interact with the blood or circulating system so it will not get deposited while it is the situation uh, if it is uh, get deposited then surface area is also leached surface energy leached and then it will not move so uh, these are the shear or the cohesity expressions because here uh, higher uh, that uh, cohesive forces and here uh, that uh, lower cohesive forces and the molecule uh, could be in the flow so these are the situations and then different as I quoted the example uh, molecule because these properties of the molecule and internal structures like electrostatic repulsion, steric repulsion, they are different kind of uh, uh, that, uh, uh, that unique features uh, of the molecules which uh, in general uh, they, they allow or they generate the viscosity or the hydrodynamic pressure or the hydrophobicity which are basically responsible for fluid dynamics. So uh, we know that uh, this completely sir, uh, is a capillaries, uh, so uh, more than uh, 40,000 capillaries or more than this also in our body. So they are allowing so that cohesive forces are not generated and they remain and they uh, equally distributed in a smaller particle so that they could easily be pumped and artery may not be ruptured also. And similarly, 
uh, because uh, when we talk that the specific molecule, specific functional groups, heat and all, then electron starts uh, exciting, and that time it also becomes, as I told you, IR, FTIR, and all. So specific uh, and uh, uh, considerable, or uh, or the authentic uh, that oscillations or frequencies are generated that could also rotational, vibrational. These are the frequencies where molecule when we are subjecting to the laser then these uh, uh, could be authentic so that we could talk. Yes, it is generated by the uh, carboxylic group or it is generated by the amino group or alkali group. So these are the, these groups are also responsible for the, for the uh, cohesive or, or the physical chemical property. So we could say that uh, the interacting these parameters or the, or the uh, which is acting as a sensor, they, are, they also go hand in hand. And now we could easily quote such an example if you see this, uh, the derivative to the benzene, uh, this pyridine and this is uh, uh, this uh, 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 aniline and simple benzene. See only the difference when uh, this uh, uh, pyridine where nitrogen atom is uh, in the ring. See that time, that time this one is generating uh, this uh, 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 pyridine. Uh, if you see this structure, uh, not a very high uh, that uh, surface uh, tension middle, but when you are taking uh, this pyridine, uh, uh, this pre this uh, this uh, uh, this uh, uh, aniline, when you are taking this aniline, uh, this amino group which is outside the pi conjugation, so uh, this is very active and uh, and uh, active in the sense that uh, uh, it is uh, not permitting these. Uh, uh, aniline molecule to be coagulated, so surface uh, or uh, or co coagulated, it allowing to be coagulated, so slightly surface tension is higher, as I told you, higher surface tension means slightly more coagulation, but when you, we go to the benzene, then, then benzene almost with increasing concentration, because only delocalized molecule, so uh, does not mean that electron cloud of the ring inside and outside different but here similar molecules so it is having the uh, lower uh, surface tension and slightly comparatively higher surface energy that's why sometimes benzene is also used as a as a washing reagent washing liquid or washing reagent liquid in generally not the uh, this uh, aniline or pyridine so this we could say that they are acting as a sensor they, if we know the calibration system then we can easily understand, determine that okay, surface tension itself act as a. So there are different properties and then population P. And uh, as I quoted the example of years of wine, and we generally grow the crystals, and crystals generally uh, uh, along the wall. They also move along the wall. Why is it so? Uh, they move along the wall because uh, when uh, the evaporation is there, so water uh, sometimes try to adhere to the wall along with the. Uh, uh, sodium chloride, sodium and chloride ions. So when they uh, evaporate it, they come together. They could not come, they stick to that, that's why it gains height. So different expressions, this uh, uh, this, uh, <clears throat> uh, this uh, non-porous thin film, if you have a look on this, where my cursor is there, it is uh, an excellent, that's why uh, the milk is boiled out because it, this film is non-porous. It is also not allowing heat to uh, be dissipated. So inside so many things are there. So we could say that uh, this device, uh, uh, when the cohesive and the frictional forces, they are the properties which move, uh, which go uh, together. And then there should be a device uh, to track them together, not a separate device. So this uh, a device which is before you, the service meter, and these are replica. These are the complete replica where one is tracking the cohesive force and another is tracking the shear force. So together this uh, this, these two parameters are determined and now <clears throat> if we uh, take the example of certain uh, uh, nano emulsions, uh, we, uh, this, nano, this picture depicted before you uh, the, in first the nano emulsion, the curcumin, uh, which is uh, uh, developed by using ethanol, glycerol, mustard oil or uh, this uh, groundnut oil and uh, <clears throat> this uh, surfactant. So uh, we have seen that uh, this uh, surfactant, uh, they are making an excellent uh, nano emulsion, weakening the cohesive forces and allowing the adherence. 
uh, ethanol, water, glycerol in 1 is to 1 ratio. So that in the whole solution, 1 is to 1 ratio, no coagulating nature and uh, no any uh, this excessive adherence is there. And uh, uh, we found that uh, uh, we wanted to check the effect of the pH on this, whether uh, by taking S3PO4, SCL or S2SO4, whether these uh, the uh, monobasic, dibasic, tribasic acids, they uh, could they uh, influence the stability and also the uh, coagulating behavior of these nanoemulsions where curcumin antioxidant is there. So we have added first uh, this uh, SCL and uh, uh, now if you have a look, uh, this uh, SCL this is the pattern. Uh, in general, uh, this uh, SCL could be dissociated and it could take part in the in the hydronium ion uh, formation and see this indicates that uh, the uh, entropy because it's an entropic system H is uh, released by this and uh, it interacts with the uh, dipoles of the water and develop the hydronium ion. So see this uh, highest uh, 3458 uh, joule per Kelvin is the entropy while if you compare the entropy of others it is not high. And also, if you compare the uh, this uh, PDI, uh, then uh, polydiversity uh, index, then uh, in case of this uh, uh, this uh, the SEL least uh, PDI is there 0.4. But when you go to the S2SO4 highest PDF PDI, and even if you go for S3PO4 lower uh, PDI, and uh, of course entropy is slightly higher. Now this is the fundamental mechanism. When we are going to the <clears throat> uh, this uh, PDI highest for the S2SO4, so in general this uh, H is gone because it is dissociation. So negative O ion this side, negative O ion this side. Larger sized of the water molecules are coagulated here. Larger sized are coagulated. That's why PDI is very high. While if you compare with this, because uh, this uh, neg uh, electro this uh, uh, O negative, O negative, O negative there is a repulsion so because of the repulsion in the water molecules it is this coagulated size is not higher and it is also predicted that the frequency of the uh, this uh, uh, phosphoric acid this nanoemulsion with phosphoric acid is higher because that uh, uh, coagulating or or uh, cohesive forces of water is are not stronger as are in case of s 2 support. So if you see the frequency of the uh, sulfuric acid, uh, it is the least among all. So coagulating properties and uh, poly, uh, this PDI, uh, diversity, uh, this in index, they are correlated and they uh, basically reflect the interacting uh, properties of these nanoemulsions. So another important point we wanted to see whether it is thermodynamically, kinetically stable because it is 1 is to 1 ratio. So where ethanol, glycerol, oil, curcumin, they are in a mono dispersion mode. And <clears throat> when we slightly heated this, then uh, the surface tension of this uh, nano emulsion uh, slightly increased. Uh, we could not find what is the reason. But uh, since uh, uh, these uh, water molecules uh, uh, glycerol they were uh, adhered in 1 is to 1 mode so when we uh, heated this thermal energy created oscillations in the uh, dipoles of the water because dipoles of the water are prominent so they responded to the heat strongly robustly so water came out by uh, detaching from this network it came out so when water came out so coagulation started uh, coagulation higher so surface tension higher this was the reason so we could say that uh, Oscillations, as I told you, we know Schrodinger equation where potential energy, kinetic energy, if they are equally uh, distributed, then we can say stable. But when uh, potential energy, kinetic energy changes are there, that time there will be a different situation because hybridization. So we have seen that, uh, uh, suppose I quoted the example of uh, this cholesterol equipartition of energy where all atoms, they have the same electronic configuration. So uh, there is no any any uh, this uh, uh, energy which is on the surface 
and dipoles also as I told here they were engaged here so there was no energy they were completely engaged it was remained stable but when we have given oscillation wave function in the oscillation so when it started oscillation it was not zero so that's why and see this different pictures uh, they are the pattern of cohesive and adhesive forces is very excellent why is it so uh, when the cohesive forces or fair cohesity changes and physical chemical parameter varies this reflecting photoluminescent nature is changed so this we could not say it is merely a uh, word but it is a full fledged uh, fair cohesity chemistry or physical chemical uh, science or physical chemical properties or as a as a physical chemical uh, uh, chemistry so uh, this because they are generating the property pattern of the adherence pattern of the coagulation uh, they <coughs> respond to the light they they generate density they generate viscosity and their uh, xrd pattern and also uh, afm uh, that atomic force uh, uh, microscopy their topography and morphology they are totally changed so we could say these are the important properties where we could take the help of them to decide the morphology and topography also we know simple example water spider and uh, <clears throat> this water spider can walk on the water uh, there is no any danger why is it so because the surface is uh, uh, completely uh, that uh, dipole dipole interactions are uniform there is no any residual energy at the top so <clears throat> had there been residual energy there would have been some interacting localized interactions that could have damaged or utilized the surface or the energy but it is uniform so this as what happens that this is by the putting its lag so this surface act as a uniform surface and if we add the surfactant into this then a spider cannot walk because now the surface energy where dipole interactions uniformly work then it was difficult that's why we know that duck in general uh, in as a toy duck is it's a big industry duck uh, this slide is not here uh, but uh, uh, definitely that is important that uh, a, a, a one cavity is made uh, in the uh, downward side of a duck when it is acted as a toy for children and uh, this surfactant starts is filled there and a small hole is made and when it is kept on the uh, uh, on the water then slowly and slowly uh, this water uh, starts uh, penetrating to this uh, and also the surfactant starts coming out so at localized point uh, just like uh, this lab the surface tension decreases and duck start moving duck start moving so we say it is a wonder it is a ghost or it is a power of the duck but it is a simply the frequency and cohesive forces now uh, this example is a see uh, uh, this uh, no fat in the sense frequency resonance energy transfer uh, since uh, this uh, is in whole area uh, uniform energy distribution and hence we could say no atom uh, uh, is uh, in, a in a in a position which is having least energy so there is no point of uh, any uh, uh, resonating energy and transfer of the energy but if you see this uh, uh, thin film excellently nano completely nano thin film this whole area is reflecting uniformly while these are when size changes then differently as i told you scattering size is totally different and this is a function of the cohesive forces and adhesive forces so completely free cohesivity so now uh, here energy this energy or this energy will try to be exchanged so we could say that uh, somewhere uh, this uh, though in this in this domain where my cursor is there uh, know that uh, uh, fret is working for cohesivity resonance energy transfer Uh, and uh, while because different molecules are adhered here so that's why they do not have equal energy and hence they start energy start equipartition so this phenomena is called uh, fret uh, this was also studied by the uh, this uh, uh, another scientist that uh, uh, i am forgetting the name and forster forster scientist forster was the scientist who developed this method uh, this uh, so i hope that and we know that if it is uh, uh, freely uh, nano emulsions then their charges could be aligned so zeta potential mass potential or or uh, the alignment of the charges could also be freely uh, made so product quality will be excellent if we develop take the help of 
uh, highest frequency and the, the medium nano emulsion medium now uh, i have already quoted the example of newtonian not newton liquid see this is completely no pattern no pattern of flow so it is unnecessary uh, utilizing the energy so if such pattern is 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 adopted by our blood so rather than taking uh, food to the tissues the blood will not leave to that side and it will cause a too much pressure on the arteries and arteries may be uh, rupture if too much uh, if too much cholesterol deposit deposited somewhere or if we take a food which is on the way on the way it is unfolding or uh, being decomposed because we know that cell more glucose molecule and that they go to the cell of the tissues and there the digestion process start but if on the way then we do not know what will happen so food nature is very important while it is uh, is a is a laminar simple laminar flow all are uniform order so these are very important uh, this alignment of charges and uh, we know very well as quoted see refracting as such so this molecule uh, nano emulsion molecule they could also act as a light splitting medium there is no need of your of your uh, prism generally we know when we drive the car in the in rainy season very thin film and uh, this refraction refraction different and we face the difficulties and uh, another important uh, uh, this uh, <coughs> science uh, uh, where uh, this roman uh, paganism uh, or oriental religion they find that uh, this lotus is a very uh, has a extraordinary power and uh, and uh, is a having uh, the ghost is there something is there which is keeping it it, it clean its leaves but it is a simplest Uh, physical chemical signs because dust particle come on the upper surfaces and these upper surfaces are like this is spongy if you see this uh, uh, electronic structure or microscopic structure of this and the dust particle they also come to this side come to this side in the groups and it is not easy to take out these drug particles which are in the group to out so now what happens that juice and water molecule water vapors in the night they get deposited they develop the drop they come together because they have the strongest cohesive forces as i quoted the example of tears of the wine and this is the example this is a single largest uh, this uh, drop which is having higher cohesive forces but it is flexible and it is also having a surface energy it is not a neutral like a uh, non sticking uh, uh, paint surface and uh, uh, so uh, what happens that when this uh, rotates rolls out rolls out so it could enter these groups because it is flexible and its surface energy so it uh, interact with that dust particles and take them out uh, however when there is a reverse situation uh, that when adhesive or this drop is completely uh, the cohesive forces are completely uh, 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 transformed into the into the adhesive forces by adding surfactant and other that's why your pockets are vast but this with water your pot will not be washed of utensil in the kitchen but when this is a situation because cohesive forces are completely gone now the surface energy of this uh, washing the washing liquid uh, is uh, uh, highest and it could move to the dust particle and interact and can take out so the adhesive and cohesive forces they are the powerful sciences and another important point generally in kitchen we come across so many accidents of uh, this uh, boiling out the milk sometimes there is a limited milk and we start keep on the for boiling the moment our eyes go here and there whole what whole milk goes out there is a science of this and it is an excellent science that uh, it is a this known uh, what happens that your milk it has fat it has uh, also casein protein so many other they were but they were dispersed the moment you you the moment you heat as i quoted the example of uh, thermodynamically unstable nano emulsion nano emulsion so what happens it is all milk is not a thermodynamically kinetically stable than uh, emulsion because when we are heating the fat molecules go up to the top because they are lighter in density or lighter dense they have lower density so they go together and they interact the stronger hydrophobic interactions and uniform there is no disruptive uh, this uh, nano film of the fat so what happens that uh, fat molecules are also almost saturated so they do not also oscillate 
that's why this is the question that when you are heating heating then what happens more and more fat uh, keep coming on the wall and the energy which is being uh, you are heating and that uh, uh, certain for certain time it is used to push the fat fat from the bulk to the top so there is no danger the moment whole fat from the dispersed medium is come to the top and then still you are keeping is to are keeping heating 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 then what happens this since it is uh, not dissipating the heat as i told you these molecules are not oscillating fat mole fat molecules are not as oscillating like a water and so too much heat is uh, collected inside inside the water molecule maximum so what happens a critical situation comes then inside molecule they have lot of kinetic energy so when they come out whole water molecule now you can check it the whether it is a goat milk cow milk buffalo milk camel milk or some other milk because fat is deciding height this height gain so it is a very simple method where cohesive and the frictional force adhesive force is a workable so height if maximum fat then height is larger so you could say this this milk uh, belongs to is having higher fat content so uh, another important point uh, in general we come across that uh, people are taking wine and uh, uh, after taking wine they feel they feel to take they feel to take the, uh, the or they uh, feel to just a tendency to smoke there is a excellent science for this it is not a uh, accidental phenomena it is a well defined scientific phenomena because when you take nicotine this nicotine uh, is highly uh uh soluble in the in the in the ethanol and what and ethanol is soluble in the water so when someone is taking only ethanol not smoking immediately then this will ethanol will go to the tissues and will immobilize the water and then tissues will be stiffened connective tissue epithelial tissue nerve whatever tissues are there it will try to collect interact with the water this ethanol which is taken inside and will uh, interact with that and will defunct the water molecule because it is solubilizing the uh, ethanol is being solubilized with them it is a work now similarly uh, what happens person start feeling uh, smoking why because the when they uh, now uh, 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 almost all the water molecules are captured by the ethanol and if someone is taking too much ethanol person will die after some time so uh, then uh, a uh, person thinks let us smoke why because nicotine is not soluble much soluble in the water but it is highly highly soluble in the in the ethanol so it uh, because ethanol was uh, defuncting or capturing the water molecules now nicotine goes it captured the ethanol molecule and water is released in the tissue so slightly person get the relief so this is a fundamental science where Uh, this uh, frequency uh, works uh, nicely and similarly in the these days in the uh, combustion vehicular other things uh, 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 carbon suits particles they have excellent surface energy while at the same time industrial pollutants so3 so2 so many other gases they are also not neutral so they get uh, uh, adhered here and when they get adhered then they develop the particulate uh, matter particulate matter of different sizes and if it is size is uh, uh, 2.5 only micrometer then it could enter the lungs but uh, and when enter in the lungs it could cause a difficulty and lung uh, uh, could be damaged so these are adherence phenomena and we know that i quoted the example of nitrogen not adhere to anything independently because no surface energy uh, so this is the situation now this situation comes that uh, uh, all what is this different uh, this uh, light uh, uh, light uh, reflecting diffracting uh, that pattern because different size of uh, particulate matters are there and uh, this also higher frequency uh, as economy for pesticides because uh, uh, farmers uh, they do not know the science uh, but uh, if they uh, increase the Uh, frequency of the of the uh, pesticide solution uh, if you have a this graph and this is the variability uh, so uh, if this is the surface tension if higher surface tension this 
light particle coagulated large size particles surface tension uh, this surface this particle surface tension higher and wettability almost nil and if you take these particles coagulated so what happens larger amount of pesticide is spreaded on the on the uh, on the uh, smaller area of the crop and also deep deposited pesticide they also on the leaf they defunct photons could not reach there so it is just a farmer farm, farm, farmer is a sufferer but if farmer making a formulation and reducing the surface tension and then small small particles then coverage area is also higher and farmer is also uh, getting good crop and uh, similarly because uh, we know very well that uh, pulmonary surfactants which is based on the same thing is uh, this previous science and now uh, if you have a, a look uh, here uh, on this uh, slide uh, this uh, alveoli without surfactant we know very well that the pulmonary surfactant or the liquid uh, this uh, uh, lungs fluid it should have 17 to 20 milli newton per meter surface uh, uh, tension and if it is higher then it will be difficulty so what happens no surfactant is there or it is reduced so we see rupturing of the wall alveoli 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 and uh, uh, this uh, uh, fluid molecule they are getting deposited and the, what happens when they are getting deposited expansion lungs could not be expanded largely because there is a cohesive nature of this or it's rupture if you are uh, putting too much pressure but while when surfactant is there pulmonary surfactant no rupturing distribution and then expansion and this adequate amount of the uh, air pure air could be inhaled so this is the pulmonary surfactant similarly when they have uh, this uh, come together then this pendant drop is also indicator because determination so uh, when uh, indicator in the sense uh, when it is uh, uh, a larger size drop we could say such drop or such material is like uh, this where see the size but size is smaller here and distribution also the partitioning so this size larger size says that that material is defunct of no use and this could be determined by this uh, uh, surface or this service meter nothing else and uh, similarly this same example they cohesive adhesive go hand in hand and uh, one can easily study that uh, this uh, area mercury this is for the mercury this one uh, that convex because it does not have any adhesive uh, capacity uh, ad adhering nature to the wall or to the solid surface that's why it is a convex uh, that uh, mechanism of uh, the meniscus while if you take the ethanol or the uh, oil uh, not ethanol or the water then it has tendency to adhere with the uh, surfaces so adherence or uh, the frictional forces they work together now this is the best example that why we are using uh, this uh, mercury as an excellent uh, uh, this uh, uh, device to measure accurate uh, uh, that uh, uh, body temperature see when it is a mercury pool and its uh, orbit we know that all orbitals are fully filled uh, so uh, no any uh, spin half spin of the electron which is having tendency to uh, share with the another metal that is the point so now what happens this mercury it is uh, 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 detaching from the from the solid surface so uh, and does not uh, use its energy uh, cohesive energy in friction so whatever temperature of the body it goes the up and without using any any energy in frictional work a frictional force however when you take ethanol from uh, ethanol or some other uh, uh, thermometer holding other liquid see the tendency this is trying to get adhere or causing a friction so partly uh, or partially the energy or the temperature of your body temperature is also working here so the device will not give you the correct value now this also lays the foundation of the frequency that frictional and cohesive forces working hand in hand when is the situation different properties when is the situation different properties so this is the science now you know very well i quoted the example of non-sticking now this is another interesting example 
that uh, we can we generally uh, say by bottom up and uh, uh, top to down so uh, this simple example that uh, uh, graphene oxide was mono dispersed and we wanted to develop the 2d uh, photoluminescent uh, 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 sheet so with time see different uh, this uh, uh, reflecting colors and the sheets because of the when they were completely mono dispersed then adherence and cohesive forces they were equal but we tried with time that uh, somewhere uh, the medium should adherence of the medium should be weakened so that the sheet sheet could come together and could develop the cohesive forces and they could develop the 2d geo sheet and uh, since different pattern of the geo sheets so scattering reflecting uh, nature is different that's why and these are the properties where uh, this uh, uh, this uh, temperature was uh, uh, decreasing the uh, shear so slightly uh, we have also tried to uh, develop this 2d sheets at slightly higher temperature because uh, that adherence will uh, be weakened and uh, similarly uh, this uh, the surface tension so uh, pattern and uh, this is a frequency pattern so if you have a look uh, one uh, single force here shear or the uh, frictional or adhesive and the cohesive when the mixture dual force theory different pattern has come and since uh, uh, this uh, geo is a very uh, photosensitive so this experiment was conducted in the dark and this is the uh, this is the uh, uh, now uh, you could ask the question why it is there you could say that uh, cohesive edge it was mono dispersed cohesive end and the and the adhesive forces simultaneously work they simultaneously work that's why this device service meter which simultaneously measure replica as i quoted previously uh, track both these parameters so ultimately you could say it is an integrated physical chemical parameter an authentic physical chem chemical parameter which perfectly tracking the uh, distribution pattern or co or coagulating pattern of the molecules and uh, we try to determine the molecular weight of uh, uh, this uh, geo uh, with the uh, this uh, shear or uh, uh, viscosity and uh, uh, we wanted uh, to measure uh, the uh, uh, molecular weight of the this uh, geo in aqueous solution and we uh, maldetox we know very well matrix assisted laser desorption ionization time of light because whatever uh, species are fragmented they go to the sensor that's why time uh, of mass flight or time of light so we found that no distribution pattern no uh, no no any fragmentation pattern because geo sheet is very strongly uh, strongly uh, all constituents are together so it was multi top could not give the uh, uh, molecular weight of the uh, geo while the service meter has given uh, the this molecular weight another important point that antioxidant uh, this uh, like a curcumin so uh, <clears throat> uh, we wanted to see the effect of the uh, curcumin at uh, this uh, Uh, uh this uh, graphene oxide whether it is it is uh, inhibiting the coagulate of the uh, antioxidant uh, uh, activities or scavenging act activities of free radical of the uh, of the free radicals so we without free uh, without adding geo 80% maximum but when this uh, graphene oxide was added, added in the formulation we are curcumin ethanol glycerol water surfactant and oil mustard oil groundnut oil different oil then it has enhanced so it shows that maximum distribution and it is uh, uh, it is uh, uh, because uh, uh, geo is having also pi conjugation hexagonal structure so that it promotes the uh, this uh, uh, it's uh, it promotes the uh, free radical generation of h free radical and then this interact with the dpph type free radical and uh, this also a different mechanism where uh, is scatter and if it is uh, the surfactant is scatter uh, uh, completely then entropy very high and when entropy is very high then there is no question of the uh, this uh, uh, this uh, uh, sur uh, micelle formation so what will happen that these uh, uh, this uh, group uh, hydrophilic group they come to they cohere they come together when they come together 
and this hydrophobic group they also come together so there are two phenol numbers is coming together now they are scattered and they so there is no question of we could not say that there is a micelle completely uh, scattered surfactant but uh, the moment by the composition and all so this is uh, cohesive force are developed here cohesive force is also developed here then a specific pattern of the and cavity inside this that's why the entropy now is decreased entropy decreased and then uh, the <coughs> uh, uh, this uh, uh, surface tension is released because now cohesive forces are uh, are, 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 are developed so they uh, this uh, uh, or is one is to one is scattered one is to one is scattered here so when what solvent was uh, was completely in the bulk state now these have uh, these these uh, hydrophilic uh, heads or hydrophilic head groups they have interacted with the water and align also the water so it comes a least uh, that uh, uh, surfactant surface uh, tension and when we go this phenomena uh, then when it was uh, <clears throat> uh, this uh, higher that time uh, this is okay but when uh, this was developed and this uh, this equation gibbs equation uh, status is also changed so we can uh, easily understand that these are based on the uh, fluctuacity mechanism or physical chemical properties now in general uh, this uh, evaporation uh, this dwarka this experiment was conducted at uh, dwarka uh, this uh, sea water collected there in the in the specific uh, 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 box and then uh, when uh, with initially sample was taken then uh, cohesive forces very high so uh, thickness of the water sheet or uh, ionic hydration of the uh, higher thickness but with time uh, water gone water gone and ultimately few water molecules are there where sodium and chloride they are a approachable distance and then the coulombic interaction starts and crystal starts coming down so again the cohesive force they start the cohesive force but disrupted here by the water and that's why it was stable and such, such salts are not suspended similarly uh, this one if you check it is sensitive uh, towards uh, this uh, temperature in previous slide i have quoted suppose you take uh, kcl and nhl in the same solution and start heating so uh, when you start heating uh, this one nhl see this is the pattern of pattern of uh, pattern of solubility uh, lower temperature when you go almost uh, after uh, 10 or uh, this uh, after 10 or less than this start crystallization but when you go to kcl see this is further uh, this uh, less uh, this uh, least uh, solubility at lower temperature but when you increase temperature is higher why because the size of k and cl is different but the same size is same but in na and cl size are different so size of uh, uh, because they develop the ionic hydration so na and cl will develop the ionic hydration of different sizes ionic hydration of cl is different than of the uh, na while the ionic size of k and cl same so see their activity coulombic interactions so this is directly connected to this and see the crystals they have come based on this uh, uh, cooling method because they are uh, cohesive forces uh, in this case is sharper the uh, nucleation is when na and cl k and cl they, they come together then nucleation start does not mean only na single molecule but they mean millions of molecules will come together when millions of molecules will come together then you can develop a, this crystal or or the lattice single lattice or whatever of this nature now this is fundamental mechanism see they are far away distance is far away so r distance r r is quite very very high so na and cl they are not able to communicate usually so they are they remain suspended but when uh, you are uh, evaporating this water uh, with time this water and they come together now there is another experience that uh, if you think that you heat and by heating you can collect a single crystal it is mistaken we tried to uh, develop uh, this single crystal by heating then by heating because water are also dipole sensitive then haphazardly haphazardly this water is evaporated and na and cl they are also haphazardly nucleated so not this you can one can get a solid uh, salt or kcl but does not mean it is a, uh, a 
single crystal or a single lattice so that is the point so pattern of uh, in cavities uh, when you take dendimer the dendimers and your uh, encapsulation drug or something they also are they also uh, been encapsulated and does not mean only one molecule will occupy thousands of drug molecule will come together will be coagulated here i am not saying permanently not a chemical option not a chemical option but of course which is option and among them so uh, the the, uh, the formidable forces where which are responsible for taking uh, such a uh, drug in the vehicle to the tissues so uh, uh, this uh, uh, molecule uh, generally uh, we have applied this for the uh, this uh, flavonoids which were collected from the guava leaves and uh, they were also uh, uh, capped with the this jadano nanoparticle capped with that and that was also uh, brought in contact of uh, this so this dendimer uh, trimethyl trimethyl malonate dendimer is having excellent cavities with certain functional cavities not the defunct cavities so they were and the same thing lower frequency in first coagulation so we can find that when it is a uh, composition uh, in a way that one is to one that time transparent when it is too much coagulation then ultimately a situation will come they will start settling so we syrup generally we go to the doctors and bring the syrup but overnight syrup get settled at the bottom so that is a a thermodynamically kinetically unstable syrup that is the mistake of the manufacturer so if you go report if you complain against the manufacturer of the syrup then that person will face difficulty so the purpose is that we have to develop a tendency or or a formulation which is not getting settled by chance if you syrup or any drug which is given and during blood flow if it is getting coagulated then it will be a difficulty and uh, now i have been telling this frequency frequency so as i quoted this frequency a uh, calculation also with simple equation uh, this is the samples frequency based on quiescent frictional forces that's why this word has come uh, this genesis of this word and this is the sample because sample a uh, dissolved sample dissolved in the medium so this is a medium and uh, t is a flow a viscous flow of the uh, sample and uh, n is pendant drop of the sample and uh, t0 of the medium n0 pendant drop of the medium and is the kinetic energy correction that's why i told that if it is uh, r3 if there are coagulation so many things then this correction kinetic energy correction will be higher and buoyancy correction will be also different then uh, such mechanism is very wrong so we found that uh, in case of service meter uh, because two forces are working and they were in hand in hand for formulations for drug distribution and uh, other things so uh, uh, we have found that uh, these two parameters are uh, least uh, 10 to power minus 7 so uh, these two correction terms they were omitted and this final equation were obtained and uh, these two parameters one sigma 0 uh, uh, is a frequency of the medium t0 viscous flow time of the medium and pendant drop number n0 this so they are taken out when they are taken out here this one and we find that this is a m term uh, because constant for a specific medium for a specific formulation and uh, this directly reflects the dispersing nature of your medium coagulating nature of the medium and temperature effect of the medium on the your sample so this is a equation is a is a manseng equation and this constant is a manseng constant and this directly proportional if you see this equation uh, if you see this constant put constant here sigma is directly proportional to t and directly proportional to n and uh, uh, see its uh, unit and say uh, second per centimeter it is uh, if you reverse this reverse of frequency is the velocity meter per second so it is a highly highly authentic data and some they are connected to the dynamic not a static because velocity itself uh, it reflects that molecules are in the somewhere in the motion in the movement or distribution equal distribution equipartitioning and others so uh, uh, this uh, was checked basically this was the original graph 
which laid down this phenomena. It is a simple uh, super adhesive resin, and this uh, uh, super adhesive resin, malamine, formaldehyde, polyvinyl, uh, pyrolidone resin, and it was uh, 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 synthesized by changing the composition of the uh, malamine, formaldehyde, and polyvinyl, and uh, uh, this Frico has uh, sensed the stoichiometric ratio and the final product which was developed by taking different stoichiometric ratio since they are following the same train it shows the product was developed and now each uh, uh, this product uh, of different stoichiometric ratios not uh, uh, not uh, uh, you know uh, clubbed somewhere clearly resolved because this is a frequency two force theory but of the same system when we determine the viscosity which is having only shear or uh, forces then there are concentration domains which could not be resolved see this concentration domain and this concentration domain where we could not say anything we high we could not resolve while this if we take a frequency this concentration domain is highly resolved so this phenomena and uh, <clears throat> other uh, this uh, journal uh, this uh, scientist uh, uh, Rachida, Marshall, Nuruddin, Kwerfeli, there were so much, eight scientists, including me, they published this paper uh, this uh, on apparent cohesity in this journal, Surface and Interfaces, and it is a high impact factor journal. So now this uh, cohesity and these parameters are internationally being used. And uh, titanium nanoparticle uh, is caused, has caused a uh, difficulty in the this embryo development in the protein. Uh, because uh, size uh, is uh, titanium, uh, 10 to uh, 25 microgram, uh, uh, this uh, titanium nanoparticle and uh, this frequency, this highest frequency of this titanium matter uh, uh, solution. And when it was subjected to the uh, egg, this by, uh, by, by the syringe. So uh, uh, this, uh, see, uh, this uh, uh, damaged completely this uh, embryo because it shows that uh, because of the high surface energy, it has percolated, it has gone to the protein which was responsible for developing the organs and it has damaged. So uh, this frequency is a highly active phenomena and it has, uh, you know, damaged this embryo growth. So it is an excellent sensor. Another important point uh, that frequency could also determine the number of pi bonds in your molecule uh, by taking interfacial uh, 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 tension, uh, it was the benzene, uh, this uh, and water benzene, and it was a cyclohexane. So, uh, then uh, uh, this uh, uh, by, when this uh, uh, cyclohexane was taken, and then uh, this uh, the uh, lower uh, this uh, interfacial tension, their difference, uh, their difference is. Uh, letting you know that this is because of the 3 pi conjugation so we could say uh, that uh, uh, that uh, ift of this 3 pi 14.32 of this uh, benzene and 10.59 of this so uh, for total 3.59 but when we divide by 3 to, to determine the contribution of single pi uh, uh, contribution for the solubilization so it is 1.25 milli uh, joule per meter square so we could say that uh, it is an excellent and it also distinguishes it is a sensor for the cation when isopropyl alcohol water they were mixed together they developed the two phases and ammonium acetate was added and sodium acetate was added to these mixture so if you have a look at ammonium acetate different concentrations of ammonium acetate so uh, see this interfacial or solubilizing so it will be good it, it act as a good uh, that uh, 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 wetting uh, agent or uh, surfactant but when you have taken uh, sodium acetate then it is increasing uh, the the uh, interfacial uh, tension or 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 further uh, intensifying the phases because it is not mutually uh, solubilizing them so this uh, is uh, uh, dealt with the way that ammonium has four different hydrogen bonding uh, site H4 so they interacted with the water and partially with this OH also so it was solubilized and uh, when sodium it has strongly uh, 
uh, immobilize the water so ionic hydration so it was not solubilizing rather it was phasing out so these two sensors or this mechanism which is conducted with the service meter itself would let you know the role of lithium sodium potassium cesium anything which you want to determine same thing here and this is the equation now similarly uh, when uh, <coughs> uh, this is the same of the uh, this uh, 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 pepsin protein dissolved in the water and the uh, magnetic uh, dose was given to this uh, of uh, 2.5 uh, because electricity passed and it generated the this uh, magnet and 63 gauss or te tesla was given to this and uh, this is unfolded and now when we have added uh, 0.005 mole per liter ferric chloride uh, 3d5 c unfolding enhanced and we found that uh, uh, this material magnetic material unfolding and has electrostatic uh, uh, electrostatic uh, uh, the uh, uh, interactions are weakened or salt bridges uh, they were uh, fragmented so the surface area was determined with this uh, service meter it was enhanced we found that uh, these are called magnetic rheological properties and these magneto rheological properties and see what happens we can say the interacting nature so if you have a look on uh, this bovin serum albumin see the completely defunct what is that whatever effect of the magnetic field was there on the on the unfolding pattern this was unfolded up to this but after that completely unfolded so this is also a check or a check and balance so ma magneto rheological fluids uh, which is magnet were fitted here and then it has uh, determined the unfolding and limit of the unfolding limit critical point turning point while when we have seen the egg albumin slightly going on going on so these are the and these are the salt bridge approaches they attack and then these interactions they could be weakened by the magnetic field and then they uh, this is up to certain limit because they have that's why it shows that up to this limit they were completely gone up to this side they were uh, because it is a kinetics so this kinetics uh, continued with time and uh, uh, giving the magnetic field 1 0 1 and 2 uh, this tesla or gauss and now uh, we can also similarly determine uh, the, uh, the position of the uh, functional groups in the amino acids if they are this the beta alanine uh, uh, this uh, amino and carboxylic groups they are slightly away then uh, they are this uh, 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 water molecules slightly as quoted by example of H2SO4. So uh, this one is strongly uh, interact. So uh, H2SO4 forces are higher. And when you take uh, uh, alpha alanine both the together, then there will be a slightly repulsion. Repulsion. Then the pattern of this and cryptohacity and physicochemical parameters different. Another interesting parameter microfluidics. These days, this microfluidics people are using. by passing electricity or automatically it is going on so we have conducted a small experiment by taking we wanted to check whether this uh, orange and others uh, they whether they have continuity of the liquid fluid or not they could pass because root this part is like a root because fibrous capillaries and this is a stem and then again millions of leaves so this is concept is called the uh, 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 tree model or the uh, 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 this microfluidics or fluidics so this also says that if the uh, water is of larger size then it could the capillaries could not take the water and then water the, cap, the your capillaries and system which needs water will be dry and uh, this is the system where one can determine different parameters this parameter uh, this uh, science service meter as i have just uh, focused uh, uh, tilted uh, or turning the physical chemical properties towards this uh, is uh, widely being used and uh, uh, commerce like by borosil and this is the university uh, swami ramanand tirth university uh, they have uh, opened a, that testing center and they are charged at maharashtra so many at other places also they are sample per per sample charge and uh, they are conducting the testing sample testing analysis and uh, uh, this scientist uh, we know uh, this poisel uh, poisel equation uh, so uh, for a long we have been uh, telling that uh, uh, 
this uh, French uh, physician or physiologist, uh, uh, the Jean Leonard Mary Poizel, studied the uh, experiment or conduct studied the uh, viscosity of the uh, blood, basically focused in terms of the capillary at one end and capillary on the other end in terms of the uh, this uh, width of the capillary. So uh, uh, he found that uh, uh, the <coughs> for coagulated systems. Capillary large sized uh, capillary is required, uh, but that is uh, damaging the arteries. So it does not mean that any coagulated system, any coagulated food could be could be could be could be transported from through the capillaries to the tissues. That is the fundamental science. And this another German scientist, Leo Abelot, uh, uh, this also studied the same but could not focus to the potential real potential of the fructoacity. And uh, these are the different uh, units and parameters which could be focused and which could be determined and which could be measured for uh, explaining the different uh, features, uh, structural features, interacting features, coagulating features, dispersing features of the industrial uh, fluids or nano emulsion. So same thing, this technology completely commercialized as I told you, generally we do not know uh, where, which kind of technology transfer document. So this is a uh, technology transfer document to the borosil. Now it is not a glassware, it is limited. So, and this is its calibration by the National Physical Laboratory. Uh, we know very well that uh, any new concept when it comes to the market or uh, it comes to the hands of the users of people, scientific community, uh, before that, so many agencies are involved for its authentication. So, National Physical Laboratory Government of India uh, uh, has calibrated this and uh, established the authenticity. Rather, they have certified it is 10 times better than the conventional. And uh, though it is not written, uh, but uh, for a complete one year in Koto University, Japan, I conducted millions of experiments there. Uh, for checking, testing each and everything of this device. So now onward, I will also write that uh, thing here. And uh, <clears throat> now the main, many, many users, DRDO, Indian Institutes of Technology, Universities, Pharmaceutical Sciences, Textile, Ink, Soap Detergent, and uh, uh, this, uh, <clears throat> these days, <clears throat> the, uh, that person, they are saying that uh, obesity, obesity, reducing obesity or weight. So uh, formulations does not mean that uh, uh, this uh, lipoproteins or something this and that, but uh, it is the nature as I told you, if we take the coagulated food and oils, they generally coagulated because it is difficult to develop their, their nano emulsion. So uh, slightly uh, uh, fruit juice or other things, if formulated, then it will become an excellent science. Now, this is uh, a, a literature uh, uh, which is, uh, uh, which is, uh, uh, is uh, focusing all the features uh, of this, de uh, this uh, uh, device which is uh, measuring not frequency but many uh, physicochemical parameters and which are highly authentic and <clears throat> which could uh, uh, authentically, uh, uh, authentically uh, do not determine <coughs> uh, the structural interactions, structural mechanism or formulating mechanism and also that uh, uh, what is needed to develop uh, the highly uh, uh, quality uh, product uh, suitable for the uh, this uh, uh, uses. For example, formulating the uh, thin film materials, excellent that uh, uh, that thin film, I quoted the example of that uh, uh, last uh, this film. When it is, if it is a highly uh, mono dispersed one is to one molecule, then it is a touching concept. But if it is bulk, then it is uh, uh, very difficult. And we know very well uh, this uh, nail polish these days we are using. Uh, if it is, uh, we are making a uh, very thin film of the nail poly uh, polish, it is shining and reflecting the light. Shining in a sense, reflecting the light. So our skin will not, or, or cosmetics will not absorb. But if it is multi, multi-coagulating, 
or multi layers that time the light will not be emitted rather the light will be absorbed by the body so when this light if uv light is absorbed by the body you can easily understand what will happen so uh, this is highly this device and this physical chemical parameter and fluorochemistry chemistry they are basically the industrial products industrial designing so uh, now i wanted to convey these things and if any question query anything uh, you can please uh, or you can guide me what to do next hello ha ji thank you madam thank you madam uh, thank you madam no no query no question nidhi madam nidhi madam okay uh, so uh, nidhi madam uh, uh, as madam i really appreciate uh, poonam dwedi madam that uh, she has very nicely uh, very nicely and very uh, practically madam i appreciate you please that you have very nicely honestly and practically uh, 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 explain the uh, this uh, uh, knowledge exchange uh, activity no so it is uh, informative and it is up to your mark madam no no puna madam no thank you great madam uh, poonam madam poonam madam uh, uh, matlab uh, tr i tried uh, i tried my uh, i tried my uh, i i i try to uh, uh, exchange uh, uh, the knowledge na acha to aapne record kiya did you record this madam you should have recorded and you should have put on your university website ha to definitely i will uh, definitely this slides are for you now it is your property madam and i can also nahi madam aisa to nahi hai hum to aap you uh, lokhande sir and uh, i really lokhande sir is, is my mentor lokhande sir is my uh, guru ji lokhande sir is everything for me sir kabhi karna padega na lokhande sir is everything for me 
सो आई मैडम वट एवर लोखंड है सर डू नो ऑर्डर मी आई लाइक ए ओबीडियंट डिसाइपल आई हैव टू फॉलो हिम I am also his big fan, as in Nidhi Madam. <laughs> Nidhi Madam. <laughs> Madam, he is my godfather. He is my godfather. हाँ ग्रेट पर्सनैलिटी ग्रेट पर्सनैलिटी ग्रेट पर्सनैलिटी रियली प्लीज पास ऑन माई रिगार्ड्स टू हिम सो नाउ इट इज ओके सर सेव कर मैडम इफ आई आई मे ऑल्सो सेंड द रिकॉर्डिंग टू यू ना सर कहा मुझे पहले पता था तो एक सेकेंड मैडम सर नहीं यहाँ नहीं है सर नहीं सर वो डैमेज ना हो जाए सर एक सेकंड इसको क्लिक करो एक सेकंड सर एक सेकंड सर सर एक सेकंड नहीं यहाँ नहीं हाँ यही है यही है सर नहीं यही सर ओके थैंक यू वेरी मच मैडम रोगी क्लिक कर दो सर उनको वीरेंद्र सर को बुला सकते हो आपने क्लिक किया क्लिक किया तो बोल वीरेंद्र सर को बुला सकते हो सेकेंड वीरेंद्र सर को बुला दो अभी हम ये कर रहे हैं ना मैडम जो सेव कर रहे थे ना तो वही हम जो है ना उसको रिकॉर्ड करके बंद करने के उसमें थे अभी पहले तो लेक्चर दे रहे थे रोज है ना नाउ नाउ इट इज सर हो गया तो ओके मैडम